probably you're around this time, I begin asking myself, what should I get my big dogs for Christmas? But really what I'm asking is, what are the best gifts for large dogs? Because let's face it, our dogs aren't just any dog. They are a member of our family and should be honored as such during the holiday season. This does not mean that you need to spend a fortune showering them with dog gifts. Many of the gift ideas I have shared on Big Dog Mom are relatively inexpensive, from a few dollars to less than 20. In this year-end review of Big Dog Mom's favorite things of 2022, I am including amazing products that fit all big dogs and all budgets. If you are new here, my name is Stephanie, AKA Big Dog Mom. And on this channel, I provide information and resources that will help you and your big dog live your best life together. So whether you have a large dog now or you just want one, I invite you to join our growing community of big dog lovers by subscribing to this channel. Okay, without further ado, let's get started. Before we dive into this year's top 10 best gifts for large dogs, I'd like to address just a few things first. First, as in years past, I'm listing Big Dog Mom's favorite dog gifts in no particular order. These are just 10 awesome gift ideas for you and your large dog. Second, the products on this list do not take the place of anything that I have shared in the past. They are added to it. For example, you will see that Big Barker and Twist Up Dime a Groove and Daily Dog, and everyone's favorite, Roomba, are not included in this year's Big Dog Mom's Favorite Things list. That does not mean I love those products any less. Of course not, not by a long shot. But this year, I made the executive decision to include only new and unique dog items that have never before been featured in a big dog gift guide. Every item on this list has been fully vetted by me and my Mastiffs, Junior and Sully. And while two of the products were sent to me by the manufacturer, I purchased the other eight that in no way influenced my decision to add them to this list. And with all of that out of the way, let's get on with the best gifts for large dogs in 2022. Okay, number one. Remember, these are in no particular order. Spot on GPS fence. I know, I know. I have been a broken record for several weeks about spot on, but for good reason. I have spent a considerable amount of time writing and creating video content on this channel about spot on GPS fence. So I'm not gonna go into more detail about spot on here. I encourage you to watch those videos, which I will link down below in the description below the like button. For now, in case you are unfamiliar with spot on or GPS fences generally, here are a few of the best features that truly set spot on apart. You can create and save up to 20 individually activated fences of any size, shape, and over any type of terrain from a half acre to over a thousand acres. Spot On is the most accurate and reliable GPS fence on the market through their patented True Location technology and with connections to four different constellations of satellites. Spot On has what is called forest mode, which maintains accuracy and reliability of fence boundaries even in heavy tree coverage like our property. Because there are no wires or installation, Spot On GPS fences can be created and saved anywhere you go, from camping to your in-laws, a second home, or even if you move. And lastly, Spot On is manufactured and assembled here in the USA with an in-house expert customer support team ready to help and answer any questions you have. So many amazing features packed into this little collar. Again, I've already shared our unboxing setup, fence creation, and dog training experience. So let me just say in summary of our experience with this product. Once we set up our spot on GPS fence, I got the dogs trained which took a few weeks. And once I started to see it working, it was as if an enormous weight had been lifted off of my shoulders. No more fear of the dogs leaving our property and no more anxiety about uncontrolled greetings with passersby on our street. Our spot on fence has truly given us our freedom back and the boys and I couldn't be happier. If you are sold and would like to bless yourself and your large dog with the gift of a life unleashed with spot on GPS fence, click the link in the description. If you purchase during their Black Friday sale, which is November 18th through the 28th at midnight and use my code BIGDOGMOM25, you will get 25% off of your purchase. If you miss this sale, definitely just use the code BIGDOGMOM and you will always get $100 off, which is still pretty amazing. With that, let's move on to product number two. Second on our list this year is the 
Duo American Direct No Pull Dog Harness. Duo Gear harnesses have been a favorite of mine since I got my first one about two years ago. You may have seen it featured in my Dog Harness Buyer's Guide and in last year's Best of 2021 video, both of which I will link below. When I discovered the Duo Gear American Adapt Dog Harness, the first one used, I fell in love instantly. It was hands down the best dog harness on the market. Recently, Duo Gear shared with me their brand new dog harness, the Duo American Direct No pull dog harness. So that's this one. When they shared this with me, I was like, no pull? Hmm, I'm intrigued. <laughs> While I will be doing a full review of this particular harness and the topic of loose leash walking, I wanted to share just how much I love it so far. The biggest difference between the adapt and the direct no pull is where the cinching action occurs. As you can see on the adapt harness, the cinching action occurs from the top ring on the dog's back. The direct, however, is specifically designed to deter heavy pullers like Junior <laughs> and reactive or difficult to control dogs. It does this by moving the cinching action to a front pull ring, which redirects your dog's pulling energy by turning them to the side as they lunge. Included on the Duo Gear Direct No Pull harness is a top ring as well for an additional control point. However, again, the only one that cinches is the front pull ring. If you have a large dog that is difficult to control on leash or you are tired of being dragged down the street, this extraordinary no pull harness is for you. They come in sizes from extra, extra small to extra, extra large. And what's awesome is if you include your dog's measurements with your order, they will ensure a custom perfect fit every time for no additional charge. Duo Gear is one of my absolute favorite companies, not only for their amazing products and customer service, but because they are steadfastly committed to keeping their manufacturing here in the USA. I can't love that more. And lastly, if you are interested in buying a Duo Gear dog harness for your big dog, use my code BIGDOGMOM at checkout and you will get 20% off of your order. That's a huge discount for an amazing product. I'll put all the links and information in the description below. Moving on. Great gift for big dogs number three are the Furminator de-shedding tools. Let's face it, all dogs need grooming. They all need to be bathed and combed on a regular basis for general good hygiene and overall wellness. I have been using this Firminator undercoat de-shedding tool for many years and absolutely couldn't live without it. For my short-haired Mastiffs, I use this version. However, Firminator makes several different variations of combs and tools for all different coat types. They also make a de-shedding shampoo and conditioner that smell amazing and effectively reduce shedding during the most prolific dog hair seasons like spring and fall. One thing I love the most about Furminator is how effectively it gets to the root to clean out the undercoat while simultaneously raking off the dead overcoat. I've used other types of rakes and brushes on my Mastiffs and other large breed dogs that we've had, but none of them have been as effective and easy to use as the Furminator. Even when I think Sully and Junior aren't shedding too badly, I take the Furminator to their coat and walk away with a pile of hair enough to stuff a small pillow. If you don't have one yet, this inexpensive little tool would make a fantastic stocking stuffer. Speaking of great stocking stuffers for your big dog, the fourth item on our list this year are Himalayan yak chews. What? The lady so obsessed with everything made in the USA is recommending a product made in Nepal? <laughs> yep, I am. And here's why. Junior and Sully are, how should I put it? proficient at chewing bones. They are raw fed most of the time and chew raw meaty bones regularly. So when it comes to recreational chewing of bones inside the house, I have been left with very few options. Most chews are either too small, too messy, or simply too expensive for the time it takes for my dogs to devour them. A typical 12 inch uh, bully stick lasts about two minutes in our home and leaves a white frothy slime everywhere. Definitely not worth the money in my opinion. So while looking for alternatives to the chews we've tried in the past, I stumbled upon these Himalayan yak chews by Devil Dog Pet Company. All natural Himalayan yak chews are made in the mountains of Nepal with just four ingredients, yak milk, 
cow milk, salt, and lime juice. They are nutrient-dense, long-lasting, though not as long as an antler, and relatively clean compared with other chews. And especially if your large dog doesn't regularly get to chew on raw meaty bones, these Himalayan yak chews provide fantastic stimulation for dogs. One thing that I found particularly unique about the Himalayan yak chews is that none of it goes to waste. For example, when Junior and Sully eat a bully stick, I allow them to eat about six to eight inches of it, and when it gets to the point just before it disappears under the folds of their pendulous lips, <laughs> I offer a tasty enticement and take the stick away to prevent them from choking or swallowing it whole. The short leftover pieces usually get shoved into this little West Paw toy for a bit more enjoyment, or I donate them to a small dog friend who can enjoy it more safely. So for us, chews like bully sticks are just not worth the money. Not so with Himalayan yak chews. Once your dog gets the chew to a size that is not yet, but becoming too short for them to safely chew on, you simply take the leftover end piece, microwave it for 60 seconds, and your yak chew becomes a delicious homemade cheese puff for your dog to enjoy. No waste, no mess. That's a win-win in Big Dog Mom's book. Let's move on to must-have big dog item number five. Switching gears slightly, let's talk about yeast. While certain types of yeast can be fantastic for making delicious cheese, as we just discussed, more often we experience yeast as a chronic and uncontrollable pest that torments us and our large dogs. Yeast are spore-producing fungi that are always present on a dog's skin, usually in low numbers, as part of the normal flora. They live with the bacteria and viruses that also reside on your dog and everywhere in our environment. A yeast infection happens when the balance is disrupted for some reason and there's an excessive amount of yeast in a certain area. Yeast infections in dogs are quite common and can occur pretty much anywhere on the skin, including the ears. Okay, so why are we talking about yeast infections in a gift guide for large dogs? <laughs> Good question, here's why. Because we as large dog owners spend an absolute fortune on veterinary care for our dogs. Unless your dog has a full-blown infection, Minor yeast overgrowths, like that on the paws, stomach, jowls underneath the dog's chin, that are so common in large and giant breed dogs, you are able to control yeast issues at home for very little money. Junior has one rear paw that he tends to lick and chew, which can turn a pinkish color on the top with a reddish inflamed skin in between the pads underneath. When it starts to get like this, I use these two products to help me stop the yeast and get the skin to a healthy balance. The first is called Newstock. It is an all-purpose ointment that can be used for many different skin ailments, particularly particularly hot spots, wounds, yeasty skin and ears, and even calluses. Newstock is a sulfur-based product that is non-steroidal and safe for all animals, dogs, cats, cows, horses, etc. I found out about this product many years ago when Junior was having so many skin issues after his bout with valley fever. After one application and seeing the unbelievable results, I became a lifetime fan of Newstock and have repeatedly recommended it to big dog owners who are struggling with skin issues. One inexpensive 12 ounce bottle, as you see here, lasts me about six months or more, depending upon how much I have to use it. In addition to new stock, I use a product called Coat Defense Trouble Spot Drying Paste for regular application on Junior's and Sully's paws and other areas to heal and prevent yeast overgrowth and promote healing. Coat Defense is all natural and like new stock, is proudly made in the USA. It is non-toxic, antibacterial, and antifungal. Last year, I featured the Coat Defense Preventative Powder and Clean Shampoo, which are fantastic for just regular maintenance of a healthy coat and a balanced skin flora. The Coat Defense Trouble Spot Drying Paste is more of a topical healing paste, not something I use unless there is an overgrowth of yeast or bacteria or a minor wound, sore, or an insect bite that needs healing. While made from the same company, these two products are uniquely different, so I felt it was appropriate to mention it in this year's Large Dog Gift Guide. I cannot recommend highly enough getting both of these products just to keep on hand in your dog's storage room or your go bag for emergencies. You will thank me, I promise. And with that, we are halfway through our best gifts for large dogs in 2022. If you are eager to see the next five amazing products, would you take a second and hit that like button? It lets me know you are getting value from this content. 
Okay, moving on. Coming in at number six, though remember these are in no particular order, is the WeatherTech Pet Partition. If you have followed Big Dog Mom for a while, you know that for the last six years, we have had a love-hate relationship with our old Lincoln Navigator. It is a great vehicle for large families or small families like ours that have very large dogs. When the third row of seats is laid flat, the cargo space is perfect for two or three giant breed dogs. Unfortunately, there's a large gap between the two bucket seats in the second row, which Sully and Junior have determined must be for them. <laughs> I've tried everything. A cargo liner with an inconveniently placed zipper. Read more about that in the description. A cardboard, wood, a metal pet barrier, and cheaper Amazon cargo barriers. None of these attempts solved our problem of my Houdini dogs escaping the confines of their cargo area. Until I found the web WeatherTech Pet Partition, which I love. This is a super heavy duty mesh barrier and like all WeatherTech products, the Pet Partition is made in the USA. The construction of this partition is fantastic. You can see it has adjustable straps and clips. These anchor to the headrests of the captain's seats or the, the second row of seats and it is extremely to install and is made to fit in virtually any vehicle. In addition, the WeatherTech Pet Partition has a handy storage pocket for your dog's leash, treats, toys, poop bags, or anything else your 12-year-old decides to shove in there. <laughs> and so if you are struggling with an entitled big dog who thinks the front seats aren't just for humans, I highly recommend the WeatherTech Pet Partition. Not only does it keep your large dog safely in the cargo area so you can focus on the road, it brings back the joy of going bye-byes with your big dog. And with that, let's move on to great gift idea number seven. I truly can't wait to show you this one. These Nina Otteson games, or should I say, brain games for dogs. As I have shared many times on Big Dog Mom, stimulation for dogs comes in the form of both mental and physical. Physical stimulation or exercise is just that, physical. Your dog is moving. Think long walks, short jogs, agility, obedience work, playing fetch, or even a simple game of chase or tug. Mental stimulation, on the other hand, is often overlooked and undervalued. Dog owners mistakenly believe a walk every day is enough stimulation and wonder why their Labrador is eating hats and digging stuffing out of their couch. The fact of the matter is all dogs need mental stimulation, like brain games, to optimize their physical and emotional well-being. And when they don't get it, some breeds will get very destructive if not given an outlet for their boredom. Hence, your Labrador digging to China from your brand new sofa. <laughs> Exercising your dog's mind reduces destructive behaviors such as chewing, digging, and excessive barking. According to Nina Otteson, for every 15 minutes of mental stimulation, brain game or activity, that is equivalent to 30 minutes or more of physical exercise for your dog. So what are some types of mental stimulation? In addition to the videos I've done on the topic of indoor games for dogs and puppies, which I will link down below, I highly encourage you to check out Nina Otteson's games for dogs. So that's these. The funny thing is, I resisted buying these games for years, believing they weren't really appropriate for giant breed dogs like Mastiffs and those who slobber as much as mine do. I see those snuffle mats owners rave about and all I see is a potential nasty drool catcher. Ew. <laughs> In any event, a few months ago, I decided to break down and try a couple of Nina's games. A level one for beginners and, uh, and a level two intermediate, hoping at least one of my boys might surprise me with his yet to be revealed intellect. Here's what I can tell you about the Nina Otteson games for dogs. And perhaps I'll do a more, ex more extensive full review of these and how we are using them. Let me know in the comments if you would enjoy something like that. I absolutely love them, and I am obsessed with playing with my dogs. Watching the wheels turning in their heads, trying to figure out how to get the enticing little hidden treat, learning how to repeat what works, and stumbling on the process that doesn't work. I love it. Honestly, though, while I love playing with Junior and Sully, I can't help but consider how much more fun it would be to watch a puppy play one of these games. I truly wish I had them when the boys were younger. So much fun. On her website, Nina Otteson provides numerous ideas on how to begin playing brain games with your dog and at what level to start. 
little tips on how to engage a disinterested dog, what types of treats work best, and a plethora of other tips and tricks for optimizing mental stimulation for your dog. Nina retells how she began to realize the importance of mental stimulation in her dogs. I thought I would share this quote with you. I had worked in healthcare for 17 years, and when my two kids were born a year and a half apart in 1989 and 1990, I did not have the time to activate my dogs the way they and I were used to. I had two Bouvier de Flanders that I used to train and compete with. My bad conscience made me start thinking about how to activate my dogs in a simple, fun, and varied way indoors together with the kids. And since 1990, I have worked with the development and design of dog puzzle toys and games that stimulate the dog mentally, or brain teasers for dogs. Not only is she a fellow big dog mom, I can so relate to her story and the guilt of not doing enough for my dogs once my children were born. I cannot recommend these inexpensive toys highly enough. No matter the size, age, or breed of dog you have, there is a game for your large dog. Now that our dogs are occupied with their games, let's move on to a few great gifts for us as the big dog owners. This next one may surprise you. Eighth on Big Dog Mom's favorite things list of 2022 is the Instant Pot. Here's a little backstory that will make you chuckle, I think. I scored this Instapot during a Black Friday sale in 2018, but I was too scared to use it until early this year. Yes, it took me nearly four years. I actually did get it out of the box on a couple of occasions, but resorted to asking my young kids to read the directions and figure out how to use it. That is a true story. Embarrassing. It wasn't until I received a little gentle shaming from my sister, who cooks literally everything in her Instapot, or in, Instant Pot, that forced me to overcome my fear of the pressurized geyser going off in my kitchen. Once I started using it, though, I fell in love. No more starchy water stains on my stovetop from spilled over rice water. No more forgetting the directions for how to hard boil eggs on the stove. And no more waiting 24 hours for bone broth for the dogs. Let me tell you, Instant Pot rice rivals even the best Asian restaurant and couldn't be more simple. And for the hard boiled eggs, it's the super simple 555 rule. Easy enough for big dog mom who couldn't remember how to hard boil an egg on a stovetop and had to look it up or phone a friend every single time. And lastly, if you aren't convinced you must have one of these babies, let's talk about bone broth. I will link above and down below the like button how I make bone broth for the dogs using the slow cooker method. I've been using for years. That method is also extremely easy. However, it does take at least 24 hours to fully cook while generating a nice pungent smell in your kitchen for several days. Alternatively, you can make bone broth from start to finish in the Instant Pot in about three hours with virtually no foul odor. I have a video in the editing stage that will be coming out shortly with directions on how to make bone broth in the Instant Pot for dogs. So be sure to subscribe to this channel and turn on your notifications so you don't miss it. And because Big Dog Mom is always thinking of you fellow big dog lovers out there who may or may not have just followed through with hitting that like button and subscribing, I've got the perfect product that will help you remember to do it. Product number nine is the Passionate Penny Pitcher Home Planner. As I shared in my Clean With Me video, maintaining a clean house with large dogs is not easy. Between the slobber on the walls, dog hair on the floor, dog toys everywhere, and dog beds that regularly emit a fragrant doggy smell in the room. While gifts from God, every one of them, large dogs are the opposite of clean creatures. I decided earlier this year to put an end to my frantic all day cleaning frenzies before friends would come over and once and for all develop a schedule that would allow me to simply maintain a relatively clean house all of the time. I have been using the Passionate Penny Pincher checklists since early this year and I love them so much that quite honestly, I jumped at the chance when the home planners launched a few weeks ago to grab a home planner. From budgeting your finances to accomplishing the little daily tasks that help you maintain sanity through a clutter-free, and in my case, drool-free home, the Passionate Penny Pincher Home Planner makes a wonderful gift for any woman. And with plenty of extra space to ensure your home doesn't go to the dogs, 
The daily tasks in the home planner allow big dog owners to keep up with dog hair and slobber on a regular and consistent basis so your home stays guest ready at all times. If you are interested in checking this planner out for yourself or as a gift, I'll put the links to it down in the description below. And last, but definitely not least, item number 10 is Big Dog Mom merch. Here's a quick funny story. My two children and I drove to the Answers in Genesis College Expo a few weeks ago to learn about and visit with representatives from Christian colleges from around the country. It was an amazing experience for all of us, especially my 12-year-old son, who was overjoyed at all the free college swag, as he called it, pens, mugs, stress balls, and even t-shirts. He kept calling it his swag bag. Of course, my daughter kept correcting him every time he said it. It's not called swag, it's merch. <laughs> so whether you wanna call it swag or merch, Big Dog Mom has created some awesome Big Dog inspired designs just for you and the Big Dog lover in your life. With awesome designs for men and women, big dog moms and dads, and even a few Mastiff-specific designs, the unique gifts in the Big Dog Mom Shop will make a fantastic Christmas gift. There are a plethora of items to choose from, from premium t-shirts, sweatshirts, mugs, hats, stickers, aprons, and more. So many options to fit any preference, style, or size. Here are a few of the items I've purchased for myself and absolutely love. So this coffee mug I use every morning and it does a fantastic job of keeping, keeping my coffee hot. These tank tops I love for working out. The white one in particular is made with a, a fabric that is perfect for wicking moisture and keeping me cool while I'm sweating through a tough workout. I love the back on the blue one. It's got the crimping in the back that adds both style and keeps the tank from fitting tightly. It's a looser fit, which I love. I also purchased this small lunch bag, which I use as a kind of a cam camera bag, camera gear. I think it's super cute. And it's got plenty of storage on the inside with a couple of pockets on the outside for organization. And with that same design, I purchased this super soft and warm sweatshirt. Every time I wear it, though, I have to laugh because I always end up with dog hair on it, which makes it amazing and ironic at the same time. <laughs> okay, enough of the show and tell. Definitely take some time and look through my shop while you are doing your online shopping this Christmas. And if you grab your Big Dog Mom merch on Black Friday, you will save a whopping 35%. What are you planning to get your dog this holiday season? Do you have any of the products on this list? Which ones are you interested in most? Let me know in the comments below. One last thought before I officially close out 2022. Look, I know the world is a bit upside down at the moment and many of us are struggling to keep up with rising costs of goods and services and uncertainty about the future. What I want to assure you is that Big Dog Mom is here to stay, and my commitment is to continue to provide you with awesome and free Big Dog content for as long as you want it. My prayer is that Big Dog Mom continues to be your haven for value and entertainment with information and resources that immeasurably bless you and your large, do large dog's lives. We want to extend a blessed Thanksgiving and Merry Christmas to you and your beloved big dogs. With that, thank you so much for watching and we will see you in our next video. Bye for now. And the ever popular I Roomba, is it I Roomba or is it I Roomba? And the ever popular I Roomba robot are not, did I say it wrong again? I Robot, is that right? What is that? Just say Roomba, okay. <laughs> instant pot, not an instant pot. I always call it an instant pot. I thought that was right.